Hey everybody, I'm Justin Buse and I'm here to demonstrate to you the Particle Shop Flame Pack Particles and show you a little bit about how they work and some of the little tiny tips that I use including starting here which um, is really lowering the brightness and contrast a little since I know I'm going to light the picture up. I also make a copy of my layer there just in case I don't like what I have if I want to lower the opacity of it. From there I open Particle Shop here at the beginning especially don't forget to look at all these other great brushes we have uh, they're all so great and expressive just like these flame ones here and I'm gonna go ahead and select one and color from my picture and I'm always very careful about which color I select to start out with because um, that can that can very much um, uh, depict what kind of outcome you're gonna have uh, with a particle so the color is very very important and I try and select something closer to the pictures range of values since it glows from there and from there I'm gonna be very subtle with my brushes working up because if I press in the brush too hard it's gonna have sort of an unrealistic effect so make sure that you put your opacity down somewhere low or if it is on high um, just go ahead and use a subtle color to glow with and um, from there you can see I'm starting to grab other brushes and heating this up a little unrealistically for a tea light candle um, but for demonstration purposes I try to keep this image pretty simple and uh, really just show you how that these are lighting up this image and uh, you can also play with some of the light around the image as you can see I'm doing and the reason I do that is um, to add into the effect that the flame might not just be adding to the light but it could be also partially causing it and um, so again as you can see I'm kind of just bouncing around with different brushes here and uh, some of them like the one I'm using here the stove top is a little unrealistic for such a small candle but it's really great to see how that they can light something so small up so beautifully and um, what you can do with them in bigger pictures is completely limitless um, depending on which brush you use and how you use it try and be subtle and have fun with it um, the biggest advice I have about the particle shop um, any any set again is just be subtle and um, it, it'll always come out realistic so that's kind of how I light up the the image itself and uh, from there uh, you can see I'm kind of unifying the color with a little bit of a colorizing layer and adjusting the hue um, to unify what I just did in Particle Shop with the picture. I hope you enjoyed what I did there and uh, I hope to see what you've done on the Particle Shop page. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you around the internet.